How's it going, everyone? Justin Smither, the director of recruiting for Touchdown Alabama. Thank you guys so much for joining me today on our YouTube channel. Be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button as well. Subscribe to the notification bell, be notified when we drop content on our YouTube channel. Today, I'm here to provide a breaking recruiting news update as the Crimson Tide just picked up a verbal commitment from Luke Metz, a 2025. Three-star linebacker on most recruiting sites, but I think that is definitely projected to change in the future. I think he has the potential to be a consistent four-star recruit across multiple recruiting sites in the future, but that is something that we will continue to monitor. But at the moment, he is listed as a three-star recruit on most recruiting sites. He committed to the Crimson Tide, choosing them over LSU, Ole Miss, and a couple of other programs like Missouri. He actually had a top six before he earned an offer from the Crimson Tide earlier this month. And the moment the Crimson Tide offered him, they jumped to the near the top of his recruitment. After interviewing him a couple of hours as he got that offer, he told me that Alabama was his dream school. It was a dream offer for him. He was super pumped when the Crimson Tide's defensive coordinator came, Walmart called, and told him that he had had an offer from the Crimson Tide. And their relationship just flourished from there, I remember checking in with them. He told me that Alabama was in a really, really good position for them just based on how they were recruiting him, that they were showing a lot of love. Things were starting to look really good for the Crimson Tide. He did manage to get on campus actually on last week on Thursday. Got a chance to unofficially visit the Crimson Tide, and he said that visit was awesome and basically said he was excited for Sunday to make his announcement public and now you all know that he is verbally committed to the Crimson Tide and this is a great get for the Crimson Tide on the field because I do like to talk about what these guys bring on the field this is my favorite part of this job of course but he's looking at a guy who's six foot three 220 pounds so he has the frame he has the length that is the frame that you're going to consistently go after when it comes to linebackers, off the, specifically off the ball linebackers in this new age of football, you need those hybrid versatile linebackers. And you got a guy like Luke Metz who looks a lot like a guy like Jahad Campbell who's on Alamo's roster now in terms of frame and length. And he's a guy who bringing a lot, who's going to bring a lot of physicality along with athleticism. I think the thing that really stands out when you watch this film is that physicality, the way that he's able to sift through traffic and get to the football. This is a guy who has a tendency to meet ball carriers in the hole and he's bringing his hard hat he's making some big hits in the holes he's a physical aggressive linebacker that is one of the things that first stands out when you turn on turn on the first couple of plays when you're watching Luke Metz but another thing that really stands out is his ability to play in space you see the way that he breaks down in space almost looks as if he's mirroring a basketball player you have to get in that stance you know a guy who you know a guy is being taught well he breaks down bends his knees breaks down in space looks like a basketball player you know that he's getting taught well in that aspect and of course that is the way you defend those shifty wide receivers and running backs who are just continuing to get better when it comes to football in general so he has that in his bag he also has the ability to drop back in coverage you see him covering slot wide receivers you see him covering receivers just in general in coverage at the linebacker position he looks comfortable there he looks comfortable he look, looks loose and his hips look flexible in his hips so you see the way that he plays there so there's a lot of potential when it comes to Luke Metz and that is one of the reasons all those reasons are why I feel he is going to be on pace to be a four-star consistent four-star recruit across multiple recruiting sites in the future but he's going to join the 2025 recruiting class for the Crimson Tide that is look that is looking like it's going to have a strong defensive base at least at this moment and I think that is something to note because Kev Kalen DeBoer and what he's known for. He's known for being more of an offensive-minded head coach. But his first recruiting class for the Crimson Tide is shaping up to be one. That at least at this point in time, is led on the defensive side of football with the commitments that they have. When you got commitments from Miles Johnson, Luke Metz today, Abdul Sanders also have commitments from a lot of defensive players. Antonio Coleman along the defensive front has Amir Smith who could play on either side of the football. And I know Derek Smith is already considered one of the top wide receivers in the 2025 recruiting class, but I've seen him play. That kid can play safety linebacker he can play so many different positions at the next level if he wanted to I think he's going to have his choice when he's up when it comes to him making that decision when he officially arrives in Tuscaloosa I think he's a guy I think he's going to have to get reevaluated when he gets to Tuscaloosa because I think they're going to say whoa 
Where do we really, really want this guy once they get him in their hands and get an opportunity to see him from day to day? I have, have, I have, an, I have had an opportunity to see him a couple of different times. He's been really, really impressive. But that is the update I want to provide you guys with the Crimson Top picking up a verbal commitment from Luke Metz out of Mills Creek High School in Georgia. As always, thank you guys so much for joining me today. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and that like button before you leave.